Hi Brent, here are some of the chord grips to uh, get through Joy to the World successfully. In measure one, I would try to play the G chord the more difficult way, which is your ring finger on the low G note and your pink <coughs> pinky on the high G note. And I would let the thumb pluck the low E string and your first two fingers come up there. But let's just go over the chord grips. So there's your G. You're only playing the low G and the high G. And the second string is open. Then you've got this little bit of a D chord here. Normally we play D like that. So in this case, I mean, you could feel free to play a whole D, but in the written music you don't need the third string. Then you've got a little bit of a C chord. So you've got a full G, just pretty much a full G without these two fingers, to two treble notes on a D chord to a C. So practice G, D, C, G, D, C. And when you hit this D, it's altered again. You know, you're not playing the third string. So the treble notes are So when you play it, as written on the paper, your thumb is hitting the sixth string. So you've got, and then the lowest note of the second beat is the G string. So you hear, sorry. Those are the lowest notes. So the highest notes are and the lowest notes are the middle notes are the second string. It goes from open to the third fret to the first fret. It's pretty interesting to see how these voices are written. So when we put the first two strings together, we have G, D, C. That's it. And when we put the bass notes together, we have Here's what the right hand's doing. G grip, D grip, with just these two fingers, or these two fingers, to C grip. And it all settles on a G, and that's perfectly fine to play, but the written music has the G in measure two right there. Fourth string, fifth fret, third string, fourth fret, second string, third fret. So that just makes a nice, more nicely voiced G for these purposes. So we have So when you switch from the last beat of the first measure to the first beat of the second measure, you have... Watch how that first finger slides from the... to the... My camera angle's weird, okay, I guess a little bit, but it's the first finger sliding from the C chord to the G chord. C chord to the G chord. That's an F shape. That's a miniature chord version of that big bar. So we have at the end of measure two, we've got a little pickup note. It's a C chord with an A in it which is weird. 
So it's a high C and a low C, but instead of a traditional C chord, you're moving that little finger down to make an A. Because I bet we're going to want to hear this voice under the A note. We're going to want to hear that move to, I bet, so. So, from measure two into measure three we have C chord with an A to open G. So, grip one was a big G. Grip two was a little D. Then a C. To a C with an A note, to a G, to this D voice, and that's going to be, it's a C shape chord, but it's really D, F sharp, and A. Play quick middle C and back it up to a and that's really a G chord so the grips are G a little D with no fretted third string little C G C with an A, open 4-3-2 to imply a quick G, D F sharp A, middle C, a little bit of a G chord, just the guts of a G chord, second fret of the fifth string B. Okay, I'm going to play it without talking it through. really slow. One and two and whoops again two and okay even slower. One two That's almost all of line one, and at the very end of line one, <clears throat> we have an inverted G chord. All right, so let's play the last, the last chord of line one. You're gonna play the second fret of the low uh, A string. That's the B. And you're gonna play the third fret of the B string. So this is just a G chord without a G on the bottom. If you want to play the whole thing, good, you can play that big guy there. So you have this. One, two. 
One, two. All right. So <clears throat> let's play along and uh, I'll play the treble notes. Why don't you play the lowest notes that you see played? So here's your part. Sorry. Ready? Again, your part. One, two. My part. One, two. Okay. Ready and play and. Again, you take the low part, I'll take the high. One and two and. All right, let's switch. <clears throat> you take that high part, now I'm gonna take the low part. One and two and. Alright, that's just line one. Shoot me a text or an email. Let me know how you're doing with it, and I'll make the same video for line two. Hmm, here's a preview of line two. Uh, line two. if I could play tonight. Ready? Line two. two. All right. Um, cool. Have fun. Let me know when you're ready for the next video.